U.S. President Joe Biden left Saudi Arabia on Saturday after his first tour of the Middle East. His short visit was marked by controversial images of him meeting Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman. In a speech in Jeddah, the U.S. president promised that his country would not turn away from the Middle East by leaving a vacuum that could be filled by China, Russia or Iran. It's only becoming clear to me that how close the inter- President Biden also outlined an agreement for U.S. troops to leave a strategically located island in the Red Sea in order to allow Saudi Arabia to take control and develop it. China, Russia or Iran will seek to build on this moment with active principle American leadership. The Crown Prince agreed to increase oil production to 13 million barrels a day, but said his country would be unable to increase output any further to meet increased demand for oil amid the global energy crisis. President Biden was earlier criticized for greeting Mohammed bin Salman with a fist bump, despite the Crown Prince being accused of masterminding the murder of Saudi journalist Jamal Khashoggi in 2018. He also pledged $1 billion in support of short and long-term food security in the Middle East and North Africa.